All right, guys, Mikey here from Mikey's Iron Rage. And guys, I got the ultimate Mr. Olympia comparison video for use today. And we're going to do it on Jay Cutler versus Phil Heath at the 2011 Mr. Olympia. Now, guys, you've probably seen this matchup before between Phil and Jay at the 2011 Mr. Olympia. But I doubt you guys have ever seen it in a direct video comparison by Mikey's Iron Rage. Because I've done a bunch of these on my old channel, Mikey Strength and Fitness. And if you're new to my channel, the first part of the video is them posing individually. And the second part of the video is them posing side by side. And I try to get them pose for pose the best that I can for you guys. Just so we can see the difference in the physiques. And it takes a lot of editing and shit. But once the video's done... I think that you guys will enjoy it because, like I said, I try to get them pose for pose the best that I can for you guys. And I don't know about yous, but my God, does Phil and Jay Cutler look fucking great here. I never realized how good Jay Cutler was here in 2011. He looked really good. And if it wasn't for Phil Heath, Jay Cutler would have won another Olympia, making it five Sandals for Jay. But Phil Heath just came into the 2011 Mr. Olympia, and he was just, I mean, unbelievable. He couldn't be denied anymore. He looked so good. I mean, he always, always looked good in 2010, 2008. 2009 was an off year, but 2011, my God. And I always say I love the 2013 version of Phil. But this 2011 night show footage of the gift Phil Heath was just on another level. He just nailed it. He looked a lot better at the uh, night show than he did in prejudging, in my opinion. I mean, he looked good in prejudging, but he looked better at the night show, in my opinion. But I digress. And you know what? My favorite part of Phil's posing routine is is when Phil Heath comes walking out on stage in 2011. He looks like a complete fucking badass. So for all the shit that I give Phil from 2010 to 2013, he was untouchable. But from 2014 on, not so much at all. But I digress. I don't know what happened to Phil Heath from 2013 to 2014, but he totally blew himself the fuck out. I just guess he tried to get too big. You know what I mean, guys? And he was using way too much IGF-1, insulin, peptides, all that crap. And then 2015 comes rolling around, and he did look better, but he was already blown out in 2014. So when 2015 came around, yeah, he looked better, but he didn't look like he did in 2013 or 2011 for that matter. But anyways, I digress. All right, guys, this is the second part of the video, and this is them posing side by side. And like I said, I try to edit it where I can get it, you know, these guys pose for pose for use so you can really see the difference in the physiques. And look at fucking Phil. Phil looks great, but Jay is fucking ripped as well. Look at Jay. Wow, Jay's got a mean rear double bicep. Wow, in 2011, it looked really good. It looked better than it did in 2009, in my opinion. But Phil's got him in the rear lat spread. Uh, Phil's got him in the Christmas tree department. Phil's got him from behind, no doubt about it. But Jay Cutler's not too bad from behind. And imagine Jay Cutler didn't tear his bicep after 2011. Imagine what he would have looked like in 2012 if he came back to compete. Because he came back in 2013 to compete. And I think he placed like third or fourth. I don't know. But you guys correct me in the comment section. I forgot what he placed. Or he placed sixth or some shit like that. But um, yeah, 2013 was definitely an off year for Jay. He looked, he looked like shit, to be honest with you. And he looked like he only weighed 230 pounds in 2013. But anyways, guys, let me know who you think was better in this ultimate Mr. Olympia direct video comparison. Jay Cutler or Phil Heath? I mean, obviously, a lot of you guys, are, everybody's going to probably pick Phil Heath. But Jay Cutler was really good at this 2011 Mr. Olympia. So let me know what you guys think about the video. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Mikey Strength and Fitness did that on purpose. Peace out, guys.